what is up my crazy subscriber this is Joe King Jaws 84 and today I'll be bringing you guys a tremendous gameplay here in Call of Duty Advanced Warfare where I managed to go 86 kills and 6 deaths 86 freaking kills and 6 deaths now a little bit of a history lesson here how long has it been for me since I last got like around 80 kills and over it's been you know the real answer is it's been over a year and a half so that means the last time I got like over 80 kills will be like back in Black Ops 2. That's how long it's been for me. So um, this long ass drought just came out of nowhere. And I mostly blame it on Call of Duty Ghosts because you know that game kind of sucked. And do not say no it didn't suck because you know it gotten better since you know since the Call of Duty Advanced Warfare release blah blah. No. It's still a terrible game. Let me tell you guys why. Everybody hid in that freaking game. There was no UAV. So there was like less action. So the highest amount of kills I ever achieved in Call of Duty Ghosts was 71. That's why this there was this whole one year drought because I never achieved a lot of kills in Call of Duty Ghosts because it was so difficult to find people in freaking TDM or in uh, Domination whatever and that was on PS3 by the way. So um so yeah, 86 kills man. It's been that long. Another history lesson guys: the highest amount of kills in my previous Call of Duty games that I've been that I actually played like for a whole year will be like in Black Ops One where I managed to go 98 kills and 12 deaths. Modern Warfare 3, I went like around 81 kills and six, 26 deaths, I believe. That's actually recorded here on YouTube. You should, should look for uh, Best Modern Warfare 3 Battle of All Time. That's the name of the video where I managed to go over 81 kills in Modern Warfare 3. In Black Ops 2, I managed to go 92 kills and 16 deaths, I believe. That video is also here in YouTube. Um, and then Call of, Duty Goals, Call, Call of Duty Goals came along. I didn't do good at all. The highest amount of kills, I got 71. And now here comes Call of Duty Advanced Warfare after like six months, I believe. Like it's been since November till now. And I finally got it. I finally caught 86 kills. Like at the end of the game, I was like kind of tearing up. But not like literally though. I was like, it's kind of an expression, you know. I was like kind of surprised because I thought I was never going to achieve it. Especially in this kind of style of a game. This Halo-ish style. Like I never thought I was going to do, do this good. So, um, I could imagine myself playing Halo at this point, like, I was like, yeah, you know, what happens when I play Halo? But I know the weapons over there make less damage, so, yeah. <laughs> so anyways, yeah, I thought I was never going to achieve it in Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. I thought, I, I thought this game was never as good as I thought. So, um, but still, it doesn't change my mind, though. <laughs> it, doesn't, it doesn't change my mind that, uh, you know, Call of Duty Advanced Warfare is, like, right next to Call of Duty Ghosts. It is not better than Modern Warfare 3. It is not better than Black Ops 2 or anything. It's still right under the, all those games. It's like right next to Call of Duty Ghost. So, um, so yeah, anyways. Damn, man. Over 80, 80 kills. It's been that fucking long. Also, like, at the end of the gameplay, I got, like, all these flashbacks of myself, like, playing Black Ops 1, Black Ops 2, my good old times when I used to get, like, around 80 kills every single week. It's just, it was insane, man. All these thoughts going through my mind, like, maybe I could have done more. And yes, I could have done more in this gameplay. Let me tell you guys why. At the end of the gameplay, at the last minute, I screwed up. I majorly screwed up. I could have gotten 100 kills for the first time ever in Call of Duty history. And I messed up because I called in the freaking laser thingy from the sky in the last minute. And I wasted a whole minute shooting at nothing. Literally fucking nothing. And that's how I wasted my last minute where I could have gone over 100 kills for the first time ever, man. It pisses me off because I never achieved it, man. I never fucking achieved it. I was about to in Black Ops 1 like so many times. I was gone like over 90 kills in that game. And I never achieved it, man. I never achieved over 100 kills. And it could have happened this night, but fuck, man. I messed up. I fucking messed up in the last minute of this video. You guys want to like skip ahead like to the last minute of the video. You should be able to see how I messed up where I should have just, just gone out and hunt people down. And called in another fucking, you know, air drone and shit. And that would have actually gotten me closer to 90 kills. So, um, so yeah, man, I, I like screwed up majorly here. I could have gotten more. So, um, and by the way, the weapon that I'm using, since I didn't mention, like, for the whole time I've been talking for the past four minutes, uh, the weapon that I'm using is called the Ameli. It's actually an OP weapon here in Call of Duty Advanced Warfare where it gets you, like, around a kill, like, per five bullets. It actually takes five bullets to take on an enemy, and I noticed that, like, at the end of the video where I actually took out an enemy with my last five bullets of the mag. So it's insane, man. This fucking gun is insanely strong, which can last you like for a whole minute and a half if you keep on shooting people. You can take out like around nine people down and you'll still have enough ammo in your freaking 
mag to take out a lot more. So this Ameli gun is, is OP as fuck. Hopefully they don't update it because um, I hate the other guns, man. I, I don't like using the AK or the HP or the ASM, whatever. The ASM one, it's actually pretty good. But I got tired of it. I got tired of rushing that I was like, eh, fuck this. You know, I just want a more of a comp, you know, style weapon that can give me kills instantly. And I found it. And this gives me a little bit of motivation of play playing Black Ops 3 now. Seeing how good I did in this gameplay, rolling into Black Ops 3, like right on the first week, I will test out the LMGs. Seriously, like in the past... Four games that I played of Call of Duty: Call of Duty uh, Black Ops One, Black Ops Two, uh, Call of Duty Ghost and Modern Warfare Three. There are always LMGs appearing out of nowhere that become good. Like always, and that takes like around a month and a half because a lot of the YouTubers out there do not test out LMGs first. They test out assault rifles and SMGs. So this year, upcoming, like in Black Ops Three, I will go rad. I will go like reverse. I will test out the LMGs first, and then I'll go to the SMGs and assault rifles. So uh, when it comes down to best class setups, the first thing you're gonna see are the LMGs, because I'm pretty sure it's gonna be better though, because since they have more ammo, they have more power pack and shit, and most of the guns are not like updated and shit. So, um, so yeah, LMGs are gonna come first next next uh, next year in Black Ops 3. Guess me, it's getting me a little bit pumped, but it still doesn't change the fact that I hate this Hellowish style kind of game, but. Damn, man, I achieved like 86 kills. Kind of insane. Especially in this map, Terrence map. I never thought I was going to do good, but now it's my favorite map. <laughs> so, um, so yeah, the maps in this game are pretty good, too. So, Black Ops didn't kind of learn from these kinds of maps. Hopefully, hopefully they don't majorly screw up in the maps. Hopefully they don't. So, um, anyways, and also my kill streaks. Just in case you're wondering, why don't I have Paladin? No, why... Joe, why don't you have Paladin? You got this so many kills in this gameplay. You could have gone like around like around five Paladins in this whole game. Well, the reason why I didn't put the Paladins as a score streak in this game is because I didn't want people to back out. Because I knew I knew there was gonna be something on this weapon. Because in the previous gameplays, like previous four gameplays, I managed to go like around 50 kills and like around 10 deaths. And I was like, what the fuck is going on? This this LMG is OP now. Like I never thought I was gonna be doing good, so I ended up switching around my kill streaks so nobody could back out. So I ended up putting this two, these three kill streaks right here: the the uh, the spy plane, the uh, the air drone, and this laser thingy, which I forgot the name to. Uh, I knew a lot of people would not back out to it. So if I were to put the pallet, then people would back out, and then the match is over like in the first minutes, the first two minutes of the paladin. Like it's done. That's why I hate when people call in the Paladins because I know people are going to back out because you can do nothing against it. You just can't. Nobody has launchers. The launchers fucking suck. And then when you try to take down the freaking Paladin, you just can't because you're always spawning next to the enemy. So that's why I don't put the Paladin out because I don't want to be a tryhard. I just don't. The Stealth Bomber though, yes, it could sometimes put the make people back out. So I was like, nah, not going to try the Stealth Bomber either. So I just went with these simple kill streaks. So, um, so yeah, that's that's my reason why I don't have the Paladin or any other tryhard um, kill streaks. I just wanted to be simple. I just wanted people to actually play the game for once to defend themselves, and they actually did. So, that's a pretty decent gameplay, man. I did it rushing around. I did not camp like most of the people out there do. I can't believe some people follow those kind of YouTubers. You know, like open your eyes. Do not follow those YouTubers that just camp and then say like, oh, I take credit for these 90 plus game kills gameplays, blah blah. It just pisses me the hell off. It really does, man. I don't know how they have like over 10,000 subs and they camp in the fucking game thinking they're the fucking masters of the game. Fuck no, man. I've seen that for the past five years and I'm telling you, those, those people do not deserve subs at all. <sighs> one day this underdog, I'm telling you guys, one day myself I'll grow that much like them and they'll see like I'm real. They're not. They're just hiding just for views and shit. So, man. So that is it. That's all I wanted to talk about, guys. This last minute right here, I kind of screwed it up. I'm telling you right now because um, I called in that kill streak, and I shouldn't have done that. There was enough people around the map that uh, I could have actually gone for a long ass kill streak, and maybe even for a DNA bomb. And man, I screwed. You see, now I called in the kill streak, right? And I couldn't find anybody compared to the other times I've been calling in this kill streak. So I screwed up. I could have gotten a hundred kills. I have a feeling. That I could have gone into this gameplay, and it would have been my first time ever 
that I would have gotten 100 kills. My first time ever that I messed up because I called in this piece of crap. Look at this. Look at all them kills I'm getting. I ain't getting shit. <laughs> oh, God, man. I swear. I shouldn't have to call it. Look at this. Not a single kill. I think they backed out at some moment right there. There was like only like around five people playing against seven, I believe, at this point. So that's my last kill right there. I got like a 30 kill medal thingy. A lot of medals. Relentless, resentless, whatever the fuck their names are. Um, it was awesome, man. I, I, I just it brought me a lot of memories. A lot of memories from my old school days of gaining like 80 kills per game play. So that is if you guys want to play with me in Call of Duty Advanced Warfare, add me at Joking John 74. I'll be on PS4. And um, you guys want to see more Call of Duty Advanced Warfare gameplays? Let me know in the comment section and subscribe for more. If you guys want to see more Call of Duty stuff? So I'll see you guys later and subscribe for more.